Good evening, and welcome back to Timberborn, where we are pretty much on the end of exploding everything up. Let me put that there. Uh, oh, we missed two over there. Oh no, let's put those in there. But yes, we are we are very, very close. Very, very close to having everything done. You should be able to reach that. Yep. So these ones are all done. Kaboom those out. Let us put in the mark ones there. Blow that up. Blow that up. Awesome, awesome, awesome. We're also at 32 happiness, which is also awesome. Uh, would you empty those, please? Um, how are these doing? Uh, we can empty that into there. Yeah, cool. Um, everything is good. Everything is wonderful. Everything is heavenly. Um, well, sort of. Uh, let's put that up there. And then let's put in another staircase here. And then we can get to these ones. And then I think that's it. I think we have flattenized the entire world. Um, so, yeah. Yeah. We do need to move our town center. It's in the way. These are in the way as well. I haven't decided where these are going to go yet. Probably in between. Um, I also... I put down eight. Oh, I can't, you can't see them. Uh, I put down eight um, uh, warehouses for food in here, and there's actually nine foods and a liquid. So, um, yeah, but that's okay. That's okay. I am surprised. I guess haulers, uh, builders, also workers moving stuff around. Hmm. Okay. Okay. That's fine. That's fine. Uh, let's get rid of that. Okay. We do need to do a few little bits and pieces. So these are ready to go pop. That's ready to go pop. That and that. Yay. Oh, there's one more. One more. There's one more there. And I think we're done. I think we're done. That is empty now. We can destroy that. Yep. Oh, no, let's not destroy that yet. Doop, doop. You gotta put those in there. Do that. Yeah. And then we just need to put in the um, uh, places for that. So, so I'm gonna shut down our explosive factories. Um, not really to worry about workers. We've got 81 extra workers at the moment. It's not a problem. I've shut down some of the things here, uh, mainly so that they can actually pick up stuff off of the uh, um, the floor and put them in the boxes because they weren't doing that. So, yeah. We also don't have any more pine resin coming in. That's a bit of a problem. So we're gonna use up all our pine resin soon. Uh, so we need to do that. Something I hadn't factored in is the pine resin. Um, I mean, potentially we could do it around here because this will have some green right down to this area here. So, so yeah, yeah. Okay, let's let's uh, let's do the final explosions. Uh, let me turn on this guy here. So if we come down here, let me try and get the camera directly above. So that's where we want to go. Zoom out. He says, trying to see it. I can't even see it. It's, it's oh, uh oh, oh, I've, uh, I've buried it, haven't I? I've buried it, haven't I? Um, let's, let's bring up this. Let's bring up this so we know where it is. So, where is, where is it? So, it is, um, where are we? 79. Okay. Do, 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 do. There. That should be right. Um, yep, that lines up with that there. So that's cool. Right, okay. And then we want to go up from there to here. Yep, for those who don't know, um, control, sorry, shift, alt, and X brings up this debug manual, uh, map manual, and um, panel, debug mode panel. 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 It's not got an M in it. I don't know why I keep trying to put an M in the word panel. Um, <laughs> and uh, you, you can open the coordinates here in your coordinates. You've got, you've got performance metrics, you've got all sorts of stuff in here. But um, yeah, just uh, coordinates are quite nice to actually have. This uh, this this ability here, um, this toggle up here, is very nice to, to see and use. And it, it, it's very, very good. But it does have limitations of that you can only see where it is on the screen. So you've got to be careful with... Uh, yeah, what you're doing with it. That's where we're going to put the next one for that one. Okay, 
And let me just come down here and figure out where these ones down here are going to be. Uh, where were these ones down here going to be? Um, that is an extremely good question. I do not know. Um, well, they'd be at 15. I don't know that much. Uh, but how far up and down would they be? Um... Do, 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 do. They would be at um So it should be seventy nine. Plus 32, make it 111, is that... I can figure out going this way, can't I? Where's this one? This one's at 111, yeah. So this should be at 111 by 15. Which is there. 111 by 15 is there. So that there. Then we come along. And uh, we, we can turn that off now. We can just keep that lined up with that one, come along and find this one here. Loop. Here. Loop. And here. But loop. That should be it. Yeah. We should all be at 111. Yes, 111, 111. Yep. Awesome. Okay, cool. There we go. Right, so that's where all they go. Right, okay, okay, so pop that out there. Um, doop, 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 doop. So I asked in the last episode, sorry, I'm trying to figure out where I'm going here with this. Um, I asked in the last episode what we might want to call the district, the town district, because we're flatland, flatland here. And I was, was going to be flatland or flatland aqueduct or something like that. And, um, um, Kaboom suggested, I think, sawdust, but put a J in it. So it's saw, do just, D-U-J-S-T. Um, um, and uh, when I asked whether mm, you mentioned sawdust, saw just, or saw do just, you just said yes, which is great. Yeah. However, however, uh, um, Alcazar, uh, Alcazar Benok, Mentioned calling it in in Latin uh, Castoria um, is beaver, and aqueduct is aqueductus. So we should call it Castoria aqueductus, which basically means beaver aqueducts, which I like. I really like. So we're going to do that. So I'm going to pause the game. I'm going to remove this road here. Um, I'm going to unpause the game actually, uh, so the beavers can walk around that. Now I'm going to pause the game again, and we're going to delete this. Oof. Now no one has any town district to um, live by. They're all, they're all there. Uh, oh no, we have no district. What do we do? Ah, uh, there we go. District two has been put in, and we'll paste that in there. Boom. Castoria Aqueductus. Diva Aqueducts. Boom, and then everyone teleports to there because I think that's unstuckified that does that, but um, it's fine, it's fine. But we'll restart it and then everyone will, yeah, everyone resets to the uh, the district. I, th I think that is unstuckified that does that. Um, and then everyone will reassign and get their, all, they'll get jobs and do bits and pieces and do whatnot and everything will be fine, dandy and wonderful and there could be much rejoicing. I did not extend the power out past this building here. I should have done that before I put the town district in but I didn't so yeah. Oh well, a bit late now. Um, what I would like to do is put in some charging stations inside here. The problem to that for our beavers is um, we can't put them here. We can't put them here because they're charged from that. So I could I could put three in here. Um and then three here in the centre of town. Might be an idea. Um the uh they can they can sit behind here, but they can't get power from the side of this. They have to get it from the end. 
So, um, yeah, so I can't put one there. Uh, I can't put one. There. I could put one there. I can't put one there because this only has power coming out the side. So I might just stick three in there and three in there. And then um, have the roads come out like this instead. Remove the uh, center parts. And then put decorations in there or something. I'm, I'm not really sure what to put in there, to be honest with you. We could put some planted pots in there or something. We, we could we could figure something out in there. But um, yeah, so we get some more charging station there. So the bots, when they're in the, in the center town, don't have to wander back here to get charged. So that would be a definite good idea. Um, let's have a quick look at our happiness. See if there's something that is lacking. So all these are fine. Wet fur is lower than I expected. But I think that's because I only got... One, two, three, four, five, six, twelve water um, swim pools. So, yeah. Uh, campfires and terraces are terrible. But again, I think that's just not because we don't have enough of them, but because the beavers are working 18 hour days. So, yeah. Uh, the beaver statue and the clock as well. Oh, that's that's because they're only just up here, aren't they? So, so let's move this as well. Let's figure this out here. So, uh, we've got some water down here. I definitely want to put water in around here. I also... Ah. Ah. That's the thing. We need... Right. Right. We need um We need to finish a sentence perhaps. Um <laughs> we need to build all of these around the outside in the aqueducts to get the land green so that we can plant the trees and the food and stuff before I massively up the population. Because I don't want to up the population and then put trees in and put food in afterwards because that doesn't go well. Doesn't go well at all. So we won't be doing that. No. Uh, we can also get rid of these here now. We don't need these. Let's um, offload these if we can, please. Um, we can put the explosives in over here. We can get this aqueduct going here. Let's blow one. One blow this up. And one blow this up, but there's beavers over here, so... Go for it. Go for it. Do it, do it, do it, do it, do it. Yay! Awesome. Okay. Now, we are going to probably need to have a road over top of this. So it's rehab this wood. Um, because of just how things are here, we're going to probably have to have a thing over top. I could move this back by one and then run the road around it but really the road should be on the outside of this but it can't be on the outside of this because of that. Plus it doesn't really matter where the road goes to be honest but um, uh, here as well uh, I'm going to change up my I said I was going to do one big platform um, one big like waterway across this. I'm not going to do that because it would flood this channel down here and one wide channels bad. One wide channel is very bad. So what we're going to do instead is, I think we're going to uh, grab our explosives, which are here. Um, and I want to blow up like a square area up to the edge here. So we'll square this off from here to here. We'll square this off. So how big is that? How big is that? I need a measuring tool, but we don't have one. From right, wait for a moment. So... 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. 10, and 12, 13, 14. So under there would be where we'd go. So we do a 14 by 14 for the mangroves. It's a lot. It's a lot, but it's fine. I, we, we don't have to worry about that. Uh, we could also then take this and not have to do it at the end. I will do it at the end, though, because I want to do exactly the same as all of them along. Um, I was very tempted to run that line across to me, so all, all four aqueducts come to, but no, we won't, we won't do that. That's, that's a little excessive, so. So, right, so I want to stop one before, so 13, don't I? So we want to stop there and there. So I want to go 13 by, um, 13 by 13, I suppose, so. Doop. Doop. 
like that. Um, and then this is the same here, so 13 by... 13 plus whatever the size of the actual thing is there. So so, so what is this? What is this? Uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16 by 16. Cool, we'll do that. 16 by 16. That works pretty well. Uh, we'll have paths go down into it. Um, I might... Uh, what do we need to, to get the... Um, uh, is it gatherer flags? Berries, coffee, beans, and mangrove fruits. Okay, so that works pretty well because we can put the gatherer flags just on the edge here and have ladders down into it. So that'll work. That'll work. We'll do that. We'll have ladders go down into it. Um, or just, yeah, just stairs going down. Look, one, two, and three in it from this side. And we'll just put them here and they can reach over and gather all the stuff there. And that'll be fine. That'll be fine. And then the mangrove fruits just go out and be stored of here. So. Yeah, not a problem. Not a problem. Okay. That works for us. That works for us. Let's run a path all the way through this so the beavers can actually get to it to plant things in there. Um, okay. Let's detonate this and this. And this. This. Okay. And that one, and that one without the beaver stood on top of it, obviously. Kind of bad for their health if you uh, set off dynamite when beavers are stood on top of them. They don't get a space, which is a shame. They don't get a space. They don't end up on the moon and try and steal the YouTube spot. They they just ex they just explode. They just they just um they just uh, cease to function, which is really strange because um you know. Although I can't say I've ever, I've ever stood an exploding dynamite and uh, and and continue to function after I've done it, but um, I'm I'm sure I'm sure it's a normal everyday occurrence. Um, but uh, yeah, uh, so we want to run this out, don't we? Okay, so we want to go with three extension in there. Okay, so under there we are one, two, like that. There is the biggest extension we can get on top. Then there is a five five way platform there and a five way platform there. And that works beautifully and that'll do. That'll do. That's all we need on this side. Awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Okay. One, two. Oh, one, two. Ah, uh, one, two. Oh, no. Then at these, kaboomy. Put in the longest overhang platform we have, and then you, you. Boop and boop. Boop and boop. And then remember, we have to put in uh, at least two ladders underneath here in order for them to reach further up. So, yeah. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to connect all that up with one big long road. So I know all the beavers can reach them at any point, like so. Uh, I'm also going to run a big long road down here. Which basically connects one side of the, uh, the map to the other. And uh, let's connect the road up here as well. I need to I need to sort out some of the roads in places, but I just want to kind of connect them together so um, beavers have access to get to, to places whichever way around they want to go. Um, so yeah, okay. So now we need to do the same here. So we want to go uh, one, two, like that. And then how many is it before we go to the next one? So the next one is there. So... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ah. Well, that's going to cause us a problem, isn't it? Um, is this where we want to go? Let's go down. Right, so... There is there. Yeah, that's correct. So the next one will be out here. Um, hmm. 
We could do a short one here and then double this and then reach over it that way. So, uh, uh, how do you, oh yeah, alt, hold alt to go up. So we do that, 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 and not that. So instead of the um, six, we'll do a three. Which isn't even needed. Don't even need a three if we're going to do that. Do we? One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. Now we're going to do a one here, aren't we? Oh, actually, um, this is oh, it's going to look bad, though. It's going to look bad. I don't want it to look bad. I don't like it when it looks bad. Um, I'm going to get rid of that mine. I'm going to get rid of that mine and we're just going to fill it in. We're just going to pretend the beavers didn't bother with the second mine. They just filled it in. They just got loads of dirt. They got loads of dirt. See that they came along. They came along with the dirt and with um, the the, uh, the magic the object tool and they filled it in with dirt. They go, boom, it's filled in with dirt. Oh no. There you go. They don't need it. It was surplus to requirements. They didn't need it. So it's fine. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Boom. Let me turn on this mode. There. There. And there, but we can't put one there because I have done... Okay, so that one is not going to be... Uh, water is going to be uh, th no. Actually, let's let's yeah, let's let's blow that one up, and then we'll put in a um, a little raised point there, so it just won't have a crop to it, but it will have the water. Because if I don't put the water in there, that means it's got an extra edge air to it, and it's all sorts of all sorts of problems that we don't want to deal with. So, okay, so I'm just kind of holding X to uh, show these like this. But on there you go. Let's double check that's the level in there. Yes, the path goes through this one. Cool. What I should have done is try to base all the uh, things off of where these towers are. So the towers would be sat in the center of these. Um, and I like, put the, uh, the the ponds a bit closer together. But I wanted, I wanted to... We were limited by the size of the map. The map is 128 by 128. To get the most out of it, we had to divide it by... Well, 32s is what I did. I divided it by 32s. Um, and uh, and then, so the first one starts at 15 because we're ignoring one edge of the map, I believe. So technically, this side of the map is less green. It's, it's like the, the, this is less one tile off compared to this side of the map. We started at 15. So... Yeah, um, I think who started 15? Where are we? I should have started down here. This one should have been 15 by 15, shouldn't it? This one is 15 by 15. So no, so we started... Oh, because the map starts at 0 by 0 and goes to 127 to 127, which makes it 128 by 128. So, but that does work because of your number. So we go 15 by 15, and then the next one, um, which is this one here, um, is um, 15 plus 32. And then this one is 47 plus 32. And then this one is whatever that is, plus 32. Boom. And then it's 15 to the edge of the map. So these are the central points. So that so we're limited by the size of the map. I could have put more in. I could have absolutely put more in and tried to figure out how to divide 128 by 5. <laughs> Which, um, yeah, wouldn't have worked really. And we'd have had way more aqueducts and way more than we needed. Although we could have done 5 and 10. So instead of being at 15 by 15, it'd be at 10 by 10. And then done that, which then just means it would be off by two tiles on the end rather than one tile on the end. This is not off by one tile at the end, although I think it is. Um, I think this side, as I said, that's 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. This is 17. This is 17 away from the edge. So this is off by two tiles. 
So that means this edge here won't be um, as green as this edge here, which is really ironic because this is where we put all the farm or the land. So I shouldn't have started here. Um, I should have moved this over by two, which would have fixed our aqueduct problem. And then this should have been over by two to make the land as green as possible. So mistakes were made in the fundamental uh, original uh, calculations of the, uh, the 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 map processing and uh, those who were in charge of making the decisions for the numbers have all been fired so mistakes like that would never happen again so um yeah yeah you can trust us we're a reputable um uh building build, build beaver building company uh, that knows exactly what they're doing um most of the time we know exactly what we're doing until it comes to doing it that's our motto we know exactly what we're doing until it comes to doing it yeah i need to make a building company with that motto see how many clients we get in the middle goes wrong to go well we told you we told you <laughs> i mean you know what, what do you want <laughs> You wanted the job actually to be done? Maybe you should have hired someone who knew what they were doing. Um, I don't know how well that stand up in the court of law, but it would be interesting. <laughs> it would be an interesting thing. Um, right, so, uh, uh, yeah. Boom, ba -dum, ba -dum, ba -dum, ba -dum. Okay, so here we're going to want to put in uh, some storages here for things. So, um, maybe. Right, I want to know... I want to know something. So uh, here, we have these overhangs. As you can see here, we have these overhangs, which means you can't get two large warehouses underneath them. That's why there's only one here. We can't put two in there. Um, a second one will not fit underneath there because it interrupts with that. We could put a medium warehouse in there if we wanted to. Um, kind of tempted to do that in some place, in, in like maybe two of these places. Um, uh, one for berries and one for bentos because i missed the bentos out because the bentos are a modded item into the game and they give beavers like every i i thought the bentos give the beavers every bonus um which i think they do uh i think they do because they require every bonus and I, I, I think they give every single bonus the, the bentos do um yeah yeah they give but they also give their own one so technically we only need bento stored here we don't need all the food types all the food types can become the uh, the bento boxes and uh then we can just have one storage for the bento boxes but i want to have all the food storages and the bento boxes because um when we cut the beavers down to be an eight hour days they might as well get fat and happy um but what i want to do here sorry this is where i'm getting myself distracted um i want to put in uh pass on top of them pass uh, things and then we can we can put water storages there so it will look like the water is pouring in through that because <laughs> it poured through the building so long as the door isn't flooded it's fine it doesn't matter so this should be fine hopefully and it'll be water storage and then we'll do coffee storage i think one either end um opposite that so one there and uh or one there and these ones will be coffee oh there's a There's a bad tide of happening. Oh, the tides are turning bad. Boop. Okay. Boop. So we have many more things to build, and uh, lo and behold, um, not enough wood to build it with. Boom. Uh, I'm not doing anything here with this yet because I need these done down here first. Um, I don't know where berries were going to be put. I think we're going to do all the foods first, weren't we? So let me go to the. Uh, Sorry, the the crops first so we've got uh wood yep because that's a crop uh kohlrabi <laughs> that's because the industry is next door to it so that's that's why that's it so kohlrabi cassava soybean canola corn eggplant Do 
blueberry, coffee, and then this last one will be uh, pine trees because of the pine resin. And then here will be the mangroves. So, yeah. Okay. Okay. So let's us explodify this one. Um, I want to explodify this one, but I can't because um, this is needed here. So we can't do that yet. So um, we'll leave that one as it is. Uh, let's come along here and do this one here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. There. Then we put a triple in. And then we put the that in. And then we do something on the end, um, which will be in front of this. But that's okay, because it's all going to be just infrastructure. Basically, it's going to be like a thing going up and then coming across. So I think what we'll do with this one is this one will be like that. And then this one will be like that. And this one will be like that. Um, and by that, I mean these will come in towards the center. And that one will come in towards the center. So all, they're both facing. It doesn't matter. It's just the side that the thing's on. Because there isn't a overhang that's in the center. I know there are mods that do that. Um, and I'm not using them. But there's no... Like the metal platforms are 3x3. Three three. Um, so I couldn't exactly put one. I could technically put one on the end and make the aqueducts just a little tiny bit longer but then i'd have to put a five in um that's a good point that doesn't want to be a three does it that wants to be a five and that doesn't want to be actually there that wants to be um one over from that but if we had one that was in the center oh, i can't do it here no no can't do it here because where I want to put it is uh there hmm maybe I've put it up there and just have them all come in from one side just to be conforming so uh one two three there now you will go there maybe a two do I want to commit to make to seeing that off like that yes I do why not Boom. um and then this wants to be a five overhang doesn't it like that Put on. Although that might want to go up by one more. I can't remember what we did there. Yeah, it does. It goes up by one more. Okay. You know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna tear these down and redo them at the end because I I, I haven't I, I can't make single decisions up on this. Um, how we gonna do it? So yeah. But then what I want to say is there's no uh, overhang that has the entrance point in the center and goes left and right from it, which is a shame because it does for these ones here. So I'd like one that, that is like this, but is, maybe if you just had one that is three wide and one that is five wide from the center, so you don't have the one, two, three, four, five, you just have the three and the five wide and that's it. Which would make sense, because one is just one and then three and then five. Um, but yeah, there we go. That's what we're gonna do. That is the plan. This is how we're gonna do it. I will, I will build up to it. I will build this. I will get it all done and put in place. I will put the aqueduct, the, the, the things in. You, you've seen me build these. You know, exactly. They're all going to be the exactly same design that we've seen already. Bomb, 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 like that. Um, oh, you have no story. You want to be water? There we go. Bomb. And then when that gets open, it looks like it's filling the, uh, the building. But it's not filling the building, so. Um, yeah, so, yeah, look. It looks like it's filling the building. Cool. <laughs> that is cool. That is a good idea. Thank you for suggesting that. That's that's a fantastic idea. So, right. Okay. So we'll leave this one here. We shall come back next time, and we shall carry off there. I will try and get this all built, um, and then we'll start getting the farming and stuff going in. So yeah, um, might move some of these. How many have we got here? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen of them. So we don't quite need seventeen of them. We might move some of them over. Well, we will move some of them over, but I'll, I'll, I'll figure that all out. They're going to dot around inside here, so. Yeah, just so I can blow this up. Okay, we'll be back once we have more um, Explodey Dumb. Yeah. Well, not Explodey, Buildy. Explodey Dumb. Explodey is done, with one exception. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you have enjoyed this one. I hope to see you again in the next one. Until then, as always. 
have fun. <laughs>